Alex and family. Sorry for my bad kind of lighting in here. Um, I do got my lamp on. Um, you can't see, but uh, yeah. Um, I will try to have um somebody record me and show you guys what I got for Christmas when that is out. Um, I don't know if it will be the day of Christmas, after Christmas, what? Because Christmas, I kind of want to spend with my family, so, um, yeah, and it's just, ugh. hang on, guys. If you see that lamp right there, that is what I'm using. And I got my little night light, um, 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 what do you call it, um, Sorry guys, I went kind of brain dead there for a minute. Um, lava lamp. Um, obviously it's made with Orbeez, but it's still cute. It has like, I think like 10 or 7 settings. Um, but I know I promised you guys Vlogmas this year. But as you guys can tell, that's just not happening. And you might be disappointed, and I hope I don't lose subscribers. But the reason why I didn't do Blogmas is with COVID and everything. It's just not the same this Christmas, like with the holidays and what I would be doing. So hopefully next year I can actually do Blogmas. Obviously, I hope, I hope, I hope, I hope I can. But if I cannot, you guys will hear it, of course. I'm sorry I haven't made a video in a few weeks, like I said, this house is busy and blah blah blah, and I, I, had, I got my desk delivered, it's just not put up yet, it should be put up in the next couple weeks, so I can start uploading on my computer and stuff, um, but I do know, like, three things that I'm getting, I'm getting my desk, I'm getting... A LED light with the letter A and then M to put on my wall. But that's all that I know that I'm getting. I'm excited. We only got five days left. Almost four. I know it is like so hard for me to wait for Christmas to get here. Like I want it to hurry the heck up. So, you know, it can be exciting and stuff. Hopefully we got a white Christmas. They said we got a good chance of it, but my website that I always go to and see if we are going to have one, they are saying no. But hopefully God will bless us and we'll get a white Christmas this year. But um, anyways, I'm just excited for Christmas for the stockings, drinking hot cocoa, staying in my pajamas, opening gifts, you know, seeing what I got. Yes, it is Jesus' birthday and that is the most important thing to me. And my family. But the gifts are also important to me. Only because I like to see what I, you know, get. And the reactions on my face. Because, like, you never know what you're going to get for Christmas. Like, you could be 23 and you could just get, you know, a piece of, like, you could get carpet. I don't know. I mean, it's just exciting because you're like, wow, like that's all under the tree. The tree looks so pretty with that and yada, yada, yada. And you're just like trying to rip it open, but your parents tape it so good to where you cannot get the dang thing open. And I learned this trick on TikTok. So parents, if you are watching, follow this if you would like. If you would, you would be like the best parent ever. And even if you don't, you're still the best parent. Good job at raising your kids. But um, anyways, I seen this girl where she would take the paper, but she would make it where there was like a little piece of tape. And you pull up and you could get the paper off faster. I mean, yes, I like taking my time over my presents. But I just want to get them open, see what I got, you know, take pictures, all that fun stuff, and get excited for what I'm about to get. Um, but my least favorite gift to get, and if you did get me any of these, no offense, I'll still be happy with it. 
but I hate getting clothes for Christmas or any type of shoes or anything like that unless I really want the shoes. And why I hate getting clothes is because I am, like, I'm not going to lie, like, I am big up here. I'm not going to say, like, what size or anything because that's personal business, but um, I'm pretty big up top and I just grow out of things very quickly because I'm growing and I'm maturing so which I have been for a while but anyways you understand if you're a woman and if you haven't went through that yet woman get ready for it because it's gonna be coming you know and guys do the same thing they're just a bit different than us but yeah they do the same thing except they don't have boobs but um anyways yeah and my stocking is all the way full already it's got like tons of presents in there, so I'm excited. My mom is supposed to get some more tomorrow until Thursday, so I'll have more presents. Around the tree, it's pretty full right now. Um, but I've been watching some Christmas movies on Freeform that I like. I feel like they haven't been as good this year. I'm kind of, okay, Home Alone's up. But it's almost over in like 12 minutes. And the second one comes on. So I think I might just play on my phone. Listen to that type thing. Maybe not. I might just watch this. But um. Like I've been watching Freeform. But I've been really disappointed with the programs. Because they would always play Santa Claus with Tim Allen. Which they have been doing a great job at. Um. Hang on. But then. They would also play Elf, like, every other day, and they're not doing that. Um, they're not playing Frosty the Snowman, Frosty the Little Man, Jack Frost. Yeah, they might have played it at different times, and I might have missed it. But Freeform, if you're watching this, I love your guys' Christmas programs and stuff really well. I've watched it since I was young, but step up your game next year, and please do the programming like you have in, like... 2018, 2017, you know, all that stuff, and I know that might sound old, but I really like it that way, because you'd bring out Frosty in Wonderland, Frosty in the Snowman, Rudolph, and all that stuff, and if you're gonna laugh at me, you can watch that, everybody freaking watches that during holiday day season, I don't care if you're 50 years old, you've probably seen it, you probably watch it, yeah, you might not admit it, but you probably have watched it. And if you say you haven't, you're crazy, because I know pretty much every kid that I've known has watched that. I mean, yeah, some of you might not have, but majority of you, you have. And if you say you're a little kid for watching that, no, you're not. It's really for any ages, and it's the holiday season, so come the heck on. What's it matter, for real? But just as no offense to anyone that watches Hallmark, but... Hallmark movies are ridiculous. They're always repeats. So, like, Freeform is the way to go. Or CBS when they have it. CBS, you've been really good, but you haven't done as much, like, programming this year. ABC, I love you. You have only done one show that I've seen this year, and that was The Santa Claus from the 1970s. But no offense, I love you guys still. Um... If you're even seeing those, which I doubt you will, but if you do, please, you know, say hello. Um, a group tour will be coming soon because, well, not too soon, but soon enough. Once we get my desk in here and stuff, which that might be a while, so just keep a lookout for that. But, um, I have a rug now. It is not as soft yet because we haven't swept it, which it's soft, but not as soft and it covers up right here and my bed is back over at the wall again as you guys can see you guys cannot you guys can only see this part right here in the closet my bed is not over there my shelf is there now so we switched the room around a little bit and I cleaned my room and no I'm not a hoarder but I took two trash bags I repeat two black trash bags filled them all the way up with stuff that I don't want anymore, gave the stuff to my mom's friend to give her to her granddaughter that was like 7 or 8 and I got rid of so many things which I'm thankful for because during the holiday season 
I always try to do this because all the gifts that I'm going to be getting that just makes my room more packed and stuff. And the TV is... Okay, can you guys see this? Hang on. So I can't show you guys the TV, but you guys will see that in the tour. You got to see a little bit of a sneak peek. Um, but yeah, I really don't know what to say. Other than I like my room, it's kind of cozy. But I feel like my bed could be off the wall a little bit more. But I will probably see you on Christmas or after Christmas. But if I don't see, if I see you before then, um, happy holidays. Stay safe with COVID. You know, I'm not trying to be like a COVID freak, but please stay safe and stuff. And I recommend to refuse the COVID vaccine because there was this Facebook, Facebook video that my mom seen and the girl took a COVID shot and she overdosed on it. So if you're a kid, tell your parents not to get it. And if they say you're getting it, refuse, refuse, refuse until you can't get it no more. And do not take it at all. I would not risk taking the flu shot either and I know that sounds bad but I would not take it because you don't know what's going to be in it this year either so just stay safe and I will see you after Christmas or before but if I see you after happy holidays and I'll see you guys later and stay safe enjoy your Christmas and I will see you guys next time bye